Hello guys. All right, real quick, the winner of the free question, the free one question is Stephanie Austin. All right, so she wants to know, um, will I get married? Let's see. Let's see, will Miss Stephanie Austin, okay. Four of cups in the world. Looks like you gotta close some situation out before you also, you might have somebody here in your energy that you don't even look at as marriage material or pot uh, potential. Yeah, you don't <laughs> you don't see them. But wow, you got all the husband and marriage cards. Yeah, you you feel like you're too sexy for them or they're too plain for you. Wow, ten of pentacles. You got somebody in your energy that will marry you like today, like tonight. But um, you don't see them in that way. Uh, you don't see them as husband. Um, it's like you're waiting for something or somebody else here who's just not ready or just not they're not moving they're not taking the leap with you um, but you also have somebody here who would do everything you know for you so um, I guess you have to shift your perspective here you could be rejecting um, one so that you can try to get the attention of the other person who probably has the attention of other people lots of people so Stephanie you will get married, but it looks like you have to, sh it's about you though. You shifting your perspective in terms of uh, who you think you should be marrying. That's what I have for you. Uh, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section and stay tuned for the reading guys. Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your daily reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking sharing commenting and subscribing to the channel it means a lot please continue to do so all links are below if you need to get in contact with me let's get into it thank you god for blessing aquarius with a clear concise message from you all right aquarius so i asked the cards before i came on camera i said uh, what does aquarius need to know that's going on around them that they're not privy to all right, now on a sword, somebody is in a very, very anxious place about you. They can't reach you. They can't talk to you. They can't even see you. I don't know, like, see you. I don't. Maybe they can't physically see you. Maybe they go on social media, look at old pictures. I don't know. But it's something about this person not having access to you, not being able to talk to you. Uh, this person is in pain, ag agony. I heard misery. What else should the Aquarius know? What else uh, should the Aquarius know? What's going on around them? Eight of Pentacles. This person is kind of working towards, I don't, it's, it feels like they're working towards, you know, building up enough strength to come towards you and talk to you. Uh, maybe even money. What else is, okay, the Queen of Cups though. This person thinks about you over and over again and they replay an event that happened between the two of you there's another woman here though is this Aquarius I said another woman okay so maybe it's about two women one man or the other way around or two men and men I don't know y'all get in where y'all fit in I don't know. okay so okay temperance card all right so Somebody is like man meditating on your energy, your spirit, meditating on the fact that they really want to reconcile with you or make some compromise with you or salvage some type of relationship, whether it was a, like a marriage, because sometimes the temperance can come out for marriage. It's like this person wants it to be how it used to be. Um, if it was good, they want it to be good if they, you know, it's bad right now maybe because you yeah they want you to forgive them okay so this just reads as like this person is thinking about you aquarius a lot they could see maybe that your emotions are closed off to them they're thinking about you know your energy your essence your good nature they want to salvage this connection um they see that you're giving nothing to this and it drives them crazy. It's driving them bonkers because maybe they used to have access to you. It's like this person knows that they did something to you, 
because they want forgiveness. They want you to absolve them of all of their, whatever they did to you, talk bad about you, stole from you, hurt you, whatever. You know, it's like all of a sudden they want you to allow them back. This is heavy Scorpio energy. It's like they've learned their lessons, lesson or lessons. Okay. And then also this is, uh, it, it could even be karma and that things could be falling down or falling around for them. Um, like, like their life is in upheaval, upheaval. Uh, things are, you know, in disarray. Um, all of a sudden they want you back or they want to talk to you. They feel like you can take them out of this place of misery, out of lack, out of, you know, getting their karmic justice. I don't know. That's, in, that's interesting. Okay. What is the advice for Aquarius for so <laughs> much? Um, so this is be separated from this, you know, and heal, heal yourself. Let this person heal themselves. Um, this is not talking. This is thinking about the future. Why is the four of swords the advice? Okay. In the, in the, maybe in the near future, you're going to have to judge this accurately, judge this relationship, this person, maybe you will have to forgive them. You, you don't have to absolve them of this. Um, or they'll, they'll, they need this from you. Um, you, but you need to get to a place where you can even be forgiving towards them. What, why this? Okay. You have the page of cups. It looks like all of a sudden they come out of the blue wanting to give you a message. Uh, maybe an apology. It's something small and it could be frivolous. It's a fish in a cup. It's like they, they want to be nice to you. They want to be romantic. They could be using a child or children to get to you. What does Aquarius need to know about this situation? Yeah, this person definitely wants to communicate how they're thinking. They have something else or somebody else is occupying their time or other people, but they want to reconcile. So they want to put things in perspective with you. Uh, they want to come back to you or at least have access to talk to you, to express themselves to you. Um, this is early childhood. So I don't know if you guys grew up together or, you know, maybe you knew each other when you were really young. What does Aquarius need to know? Yeah, Knight of Swords, this person feels you slipping away, moving away, not talking to them. They're coming in confrontational, hot, hot-headed. They feel like they need to do something big. This card also talks about doing something big. Three of Cups and the Knight of Swords, doing something big to course correct you, to turn you around, to get you back focused on them, maybe even drama, maybe even to right their wrongs, Justice card. They want to do something. They want to be more fair, balanced. They're going to, they understand that maybe they treated you unfairly. That when they had power, when things were going right for them, they didn't use it right. And that's all that justice is about. When you are sitting in the power seat, you need to be able to um, render justice, be fair uh, to everything and everybody. And some people get on that power trip and they are not. This could have been somebody who had money, who had fame or acclaim, and they just didn't, they didn't share it with you. They talked bad about you. Um, they didn't come back and get you. They didn't reach back for you. Um, they didn't feel like they owed you anything. You could have been the mother of their children or child, a queen of pentacles. You could have been a working mother, a single mother. Um, you worked hard for what you got. You just, you turned, you grew everything. This person is now obsessed with your energy, obsessed with working with you, getting back on board with you. Yeah, this is, 
they're obsessed with this because they oh they also can't they don't know what you're doing they want to know your business they're in the dark about some choices you're making with your money or how you're rebuilding What should Aquarius know about this person or these people? So it could be a man, muscular, can't talk after 8 p.m. So there could be some parameters on their relationship. Uh, maybe they can't come towards you for whatever reason. They have somebody else or they don't like the fact that you, you put the blockers up on them. Like, nah. I'm good. Maybe you only take text messages, emails from this person. You don't even talk on the phone. You don't want any of that. And you set some strong boundaries with them. House. Something about a house. or So it's definitely it could be synonymous with a relationship also. Um, yeah. In this relationship, you set strong boundaries. This, uh, oh, I told you this person is obsessed with you. They stare at your picture. They're obsessed. They want this relationship back. They want this relationship back so badly. What else should Aquarius know about this connection? What else should Aquarius know? Uh, now they're seeing something clear, but it looks like you might be in the energy of text me, don't call me. I just said that. Like, you just don't have any room for this for whatever reason. Let's um, get the advice from spirit what is the advice what is the advice here should Aquarius give this any attention any affection ten of cups and the ace of cups so you can call a truce within this dynamic here because you're filled with spirit and you you have six of cups here it'll help you to connect backwards declutter your emotions um, deal with your emotional baggage also. Yep. And the five of cups. So it's going to help you go through the grieving process so that you can, because you got something here, Aquarius. Maybe this is what's holding you up. Your manifestation of is that you haven't really, really, really dealt with it. Yeah. You told them, don't call you, text you, whatever, but have you really dealt with, you know, the deep seated issues? Yeah. Knight of cups. It looks like. I knew it. You got something here. You got a relationship. You got something else coming in or somebody else coming in. Wow. With the three of wands is whatever you manifested. It's here. Wow. With the two of cups. Yeah. What, wow. With the ace of pentacles. Wow. This person, this other person is going to watch you. Uh, they can't do anything about it though, but it is what it is with this other person. Um, Aquarius, you need to deal with this. You need to deal with this person. You need to really close the door for yourself, and probably emotionally. I don't think you have to go back and tell this person anything, but some of you do, some of you don't. Maybe you just need to really deal with the emotional garbage junk that they put you through and that maybe you still kind of um, unconsciously or subconsciously carry around. So you might need to just deal with that so that you can move forward. Because again, I see it here. You have like new love, new opportunity, but not before you deal with this old junk because you're taking the old junk into the new relationship and the, the new person will pick up on that. Okay. Tell me about this new person for Aquarius and then we'll close out with it. What do we need to know about this new person? What do we need to know about the new person for Aquarius? Wow, they're waiting for you. Oh, this is deep. I almost don't want to show you. I do want to show you, but they're waiting for you. But they're saying you haven't healed. Heal. Wow. These cards are... This person is waiting for you. Whether you have met them or not right they say it's a person out there for everybody so the universe is trying to get you to your person and this person is waiting for you but you haven't healed i know you feel like you have but pick up another book read some more i don't know go talk to a licensed practitioner 
get a personal reading maybe we can expound on what you need to heal wow that this person is loving this other person is sick they see this other person in the background the one that you need to probably heal from all the junk and jargon that they put you through they still think it's opportunity they have a sickness also this new person is resourceful they're not a con man a fraud a liar wow it's gonna be love wow the cards are saying it's true it's just it's, it's maybe it's true love wow it's gonna be fiery and passionate wow somebody could have been doing magic okay Aquarius, I think you got your homework. You know, you need to log off right now and pick up a book. <laughs> Talk to somebody about healing. Maybe you just need to really walk through your emotions when it comes to somebody that took you through a lot. Just because you don't think about them, and you, you know, and you're not trying to go back to them doesn't mean that you've healed from it. You know, that trauma could resurface. It could be a trigger. You get triggered and then you, you blow up, you know? So maybe that's, I don't know your life. I don't know you, but you know, you, you know, you, you got to walk it through. You got to slow it down. You can't just readily say, oh no, no, I'm not done with them. I'm all over them. I'm, I'm healed. The cards are saying otherwise, you know, so explore right it doesn't hurt to explore what have you not healed from this is really really deep i hope that you took something from this reading there's somebody hovering waiting for your your uh waiting for you to reach out or they want to reach out to you they want to pull you back in this person could be doing magic you know and try to get you back they have some type of illness whether it be mental physical be weary of that i don't know if it's transmutable what is it transferable they can you know transfer it to you i don't know um but you got some new love and it is real and it's true love wow 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 that's these two cards came out first aquarius so tell me about that new person you holding it up Aquarius all right so if you want to get your own personal reading just to see where you are in your journey go over to the website go to the community tab here on YouTube first get a discount code then head over to the website and book your personal reading there uh, phone readings are best uh, phone and zoom so if you want to take advantage of that um again aquarius thank thank you many blessings to you take care all links are below catch me live every tuesday thursday and sunday night 9 30 p.m eastern standard time thank you again take care bye